Hello everyone, Neon Jigglypuff here. Welcome to another episode of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we beat up a bunch of Lakitus, Spikes, Dry Bones. We, we sent some Dry Bones to the hospital. We went to a hot dog stand and found a little egg, and now he's our partner. Our secondary partner, at least. And, uh, well, yeah, he wants to come and follow us. Now, let's get started. Let's start a fight now. How do you tell us? Let's see. Our next appointment B, rank 14 in the Glitz Pit. The Handed Overs. Now, listen, son. In this battle, I want to avoid using any flower points. Great. No flower points. Okay, Flurry, you're here to stay. You're the most powerful one. And tell us. Match time, bub. All right, let's go. See you later, Egg. He's just going to wait on the bench because he can't fight. He's an egg. He'll just wait for us. And Mario's waving goodbye. That's, that's nice. He's like, ah, see you later. And look at that. We're fighting Bandy Andy and his partners. Here we go, Mario darling. It was Mario darling. Time to shine. <laughs> We're awful quick and awful agile. Or is it agile? That's no sign. It's agile. The hell am I thinking? <laughs> and just playing awful. Get ready to battle! Alright, so I like their names, the Handed Overs. They're called the Handed Overs because they want you to hand stuff over. They're thieves, they're bandits. It's what, it's what they do. Um, we can't use any FP. Oh, you know what I can do though? I, I can use this item, Bolt Trim, to electrify Mario. And then Flurry. Just use Body Slam. Whoa, these guys have a lot of HP. I'm gonna get rid of the green ones first. And I believe that one's actually Bandy Andy too. So a bit, so he's pretty beefy. Wow. He's pretty strong. Wait, oh! What's this? Decrease damage we take. Perfect! Wow! We are immune. And we countered as well! That's actually really good. Well, okay, we took no damage and we're damaging them. That's that's very good. Wow. All right, let's use normal jump. Let's kill this guy first. Let's get this bandit out of the way. And flurry. As usual, use your body slams. All we can actually do for this one. Oh god. So got stylish. Okay, that's good. It's gonna be a pretty long battle because we can't use any FP. Oh, wait. Oh, flower power. Oh, again! Second time I got this. I, I got this off recording when I refought the Goomba Bros. That's awesome! Perfect counter. Whoa, what? Three. Wow. Okay, get rid of the red guys. And Flurry, you can use Body Slam on Greeny over there. Get out of here. Boom! I know there's one more red guy to go. And I'm practicing my, my... I'm practicing good! I'm getting a lot of counters in. This is awesome. Boom! Boom! And you're dead. Goodbye, bandies. And we got 10 experience points. That's awesome. 31. Rest of a winner, the Great Gonzalez. Oh, that was no fuss whatsoever. Oh, it's the same dialogue anyway. Okay, now. Now, the good stuff is about to start now. I think. I think. I think. The good stuff in the chapter is about to start. I'm well, not about to, but it's going to happen pretty pretty soon. This is when things are going to take a little turn. Hey, you hear the latest G-Dog? So my boys say they saw a stunning babe having a juice at the fresh juice shop. The King Cake used a little shorty in his laugh, dig? Hey, check her out for me, man. You know what? I will. I'm gonna go check her out, even though we already did. But I'm, 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 I'm gonna do it again. I'll be right back, guys. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go check out. Oh, oh, oh. Hello again. Prince Mush, the first Glitz Pit champion. The fighter was since lost. He shone truly and brightly. Many fans still hope he'll make a dramatic... He may dramatically return. Of course, I'm one of them. I long to see the poetry of his pure fighting style. Hmm. Prince Mush. This is the second time we've heard of this guy called Prince Mush. Who is he? And what does he do? Anyway, let's get back to the fight. 
Hey! Andy Andy's out here. What are you doing? Hey there, Gonzalez. How's it going? Me? I'm doing a little research. Hey, speaking of which, ever hear of the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit? Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit? Yes. This place has rumors and secrets and spades, but the Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit are the most mysterious of the bunch. These things fascinate me, so I wander around doing research on them. Well, how about it? Want to hear about the Seven Wonders or not? Sure! Let's hear about it! <laughs> let's see. Which one do you want to hear about? The Sealed Wall. They say, there's a sealed wall in the minor league locker room. Some say the remains of fallen athletes are stored in there. What? That's disturbing. Man-eating toilets. They say, in one of the arena's bathrooms is a man-eating toilet. A man-eating toilet lurks. They say, anyone who who sees this toilet never sees anything again. Ooh. Okay. So this place is actually pretty weird, mysterious. The stairs of mystery. They say, there's a room in the glitz pit with a second floor, but no stairs. They say, no one has ever gone upstairs. And some say that groaning voices sometimes come from the second floor. This is really, really creepy. Yeah, you see this? This is what I mean. The This chapter gets pretty weird. The haunted boundor. They say the champion's room is haunted. Some say if you keep still in the room, you'll hear voices whispering from nowhere. Some say the voices are athletes who lost to the champion. And there's a lot more. This is really, really weird. This is all... Yeah, as you can see, this is why I love this chapter so much. It's shrouded in mystery. The, sp the spooky rings. I don't know what that said. The spooky light rings. I don't know. <laughs> I forgot. I didn't get to read it. My friend's friend's friend told me this one. He said he saw a strange light leaking underneath the rain doors when no one was there. He couldn't see inside since the doors were locked. I plan to investigate myself. Alright. Two more. The missing ones. They say... Sometimes fighters disappear for no reason. Some say the very first champion, Prince Mush, was spirited away in this way. This is the third time we're hearing about Prince Mush. Who is this guy? All right, one more seventh, one more seventh wonder, one more wonder. Grubba and Jolene. Grubba is a strange one. His body's incredibly toned, even though he's past sixty. He must have an exceptional training regimen. Then, there's the matter of Miss Jolene. They say she suddenly vanishes at times. Some say a fighter saw her go into the bathroom and waited for her to come out, but she never did. Huh? You think it's strange if someone stalked out her bathroom? Good point. Yeah, that's a lot to take in. The Seven Wonders of the, of the Glitz Pit. Blah! The Seven Wonders of the Glitz Pit. It's very, very strange. And I wonder if these are true or not. Alright. Anyway, enough of that. Let's reserve another match. Fight. This will be rank 13, the Mind Bogglers. Okay. Wait, what? It said something three times. Oh, God. Uh... Oh god, I didn't, I didn't read it. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no, no. I didn't read it. It said you something three times. Um... Let's get Goombella out. There you go, fans. Goombella. Goombella fans. There you go, Goombella fan. Just for you. Alright. Now we know why... So that's why they're called the Mind Bogglers. Because they're from the Boggly Tree! Well, did you see the Prana Plant? That Prana Plant wasn't moving at all. They all weren't moving. We aren't gonna lose the scrubs like you. Prepare to... Wait! Prana Plants can talk? I didn't know that. 
take damage from your opponents three times. I'll take that. Get hit three times? Are you kidding me? Fine, fine, fine. Whatever. Let's just get rid of the Piranha Plant first. I don't like this guy. Okay, that was perfect. Wow. Whoa. Okay, I don't want to kill these guys really that too quickly, so, um... Get attacked three times. Is that like three turns or get hit three times? I'm just going to appeal for now. I'm going to play it safe. Okay. Wow. Alright, that's one. Is that two? Is that three? So does that count? I don't know. I hope it counts. And we can't do anything about that. Oh, that's great. Wow. Okay. And now the battle's pretty much done. I had to cut it out because it got kind of like... The battle was kind of lengthy, so I cut it at what? <gasps> More experience points? <laughs> More experience points. Yes! Ten. Not much, but I'll take it. We're at the 41 now. Okay. We got two... So we got 20 experience points in just two battles. That's like a mini boss, pretty much. See? No biggie! So I had to cut that fight out because it got kind of lengthy and I didn't want to show the whole thing. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Received six coins. Rank 13. Perfect. And now I must be going. A lot of the dialogue is repeated, unfortunately. Hey, listen, man. Keep it under your hat. But I'm thinking of retiring soon. Aw, King K. If I stay any longer, well... My future might get shorter, dig? After the next match, I'm gone. It ain't cool, man, that's for sure. But you know what? That's life, Double G, dog. Listen, you be cool, man. Promise me you won't forget you once knew King K. Aw, King K's... I guess he's really leaving then. After the next match, he's gone. What's sad? I was getting to like this guy. He was being really nice to us. King K... Please don't go. Alright, let's start a new match. Howdy Gonzalez, our next opponent will be the Punk Rocks. Listen, in this battle, I want you to avoid using any of them special moves. Okay. No special moves allowed. Alright. Let's just wait for the battle then. There we go. Match time, follow me, bub. Ooh, we're fighting these guys. For our next battle, we got the... Wait, what? Come on, Mario, let's do this. Let's get it over with. All right. This no take long. This place in pain for a mustache. Oh, you are in pain for a mustache. Is that what it said? I didn't get to read it. Well, I, I should stop skipping over dialogue that much. Don't use special moves. Okay, deal. You know what I am going to do, though? Quake Hammer. And now they're all immobilized. Whoa. All the punies right now. Are you kidding me? I was about to I was about to comment on them too. There's punies, but not anymore. No punies. Well. Wait a minute, I have two poison shrooms. Oh god. Please. Please don't tell me I get a third one. I can't, I can't, I cannot, I cannot get a third one. With my luck? Thank god. Cause with my luck, I'm gonna get a third one. And I think it cuts everything in half. Your FP, your HP, and your SP. Cuts everything in half. And that is bad. And it's like that, we are done. Okay, that was easy. The punk rocks are down. Here's your fight, Money Gonzalez. Seven coins. Okay, seven coins is good. And, unfortunately, no cutscene. Because King K's gone. That's pretty sad. I'm gonna cut ahead. I'm gonna do some stuff. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna sleep. Yeah, so I'm just gonna cut ahead a few seconds. See you later in a bit. Seconds. That. Alright, and I'm back. Sorry for that cut there. I just wanted to save real quickly. Jack! Eclipse World cannot take a criticism from Bob. I just fought you. Hmm. 
It's pretty lonely in here. King K is gone. That's that's it's kind of sad. I, I miss King K. I really do miss King K. I don't. Oh, I wish he was back. Let's see. My second point will be rank 11 of the Glitz Pit Bomb Squad. Okay. Don't use flower points. Or was that only used? Okay, I'm so I'm fighting you next. Wait, weren't you just over there? Or did you move? Wait, no, they both move. Okay. I didn't know that. Follow me, bub. Next match. All right. Let's go. Wait, it's so weird. I'm, like, I'm fighting all my friends in the major league, or not major leagues, in the minor leagues. This next battle is Bomb Squad. Okay, let's see what, what our guideline is. Here we go, Gonzalez. Bomb, I have advice. Just give up now. Bomb, bomb. What kind of advice is that? Come on, man. I'm not giving up. All right. Well, let's see. Don't use it. Okay, so do not use FP. Just a normal jump it is then. What wall are they? De they're really defensive. Head bonk. Oops. Oh, God. Oh, crap. Okay, that counter worked. Is he mad now? Yeah, he's mad. Uh, Goombella, I'm just gonna need you to, you know... I'm just gonna need you to get out of the way. Mario? Hammer him. Beep, beep, beep. And he explode. He's dead. Four dead. Holy crap. We got 12 experience points for that. That's really good. Just like that, they are done. What'd you expect, huh? Oh, wow, Goombella, you're really cocky. <laughs> I mean, you, I mean, she won, I guess. Here's her fight money. Seven coins. We're adding up. Our coins are adding up, man. I was expecting to see something from King K, but he's not... Huh? It is quite lonely here without King K around. Bomb! No lonely. Him too weak. Now him not here. It sounds normal to Clefdor. You are in bomb denial, Clefdor. I saw you being in, in that locker. Bomb, bomb. Aw, Clefdor is crying. Ooh. Right this way, sir. Swoop. This is your dressing room. You're starting in the minor league, of course. Oh, this is the same. This is the same stuff that we all. That yeah. This is the same dialogue we just got. Come on. Ready to fight? Log into this computer terminal right here. So grab the side. Well, yada yada yada. Press A. Blah blah blah. Press for match. Okay, so we have another new guy. Hmm. Oh, howdy, Sir Swoop. So his name is Sir Swoop, okay. So there's a new guy in the ring, and his name is Sir Swoop, okay. He's pretty, it's a, it's a cute little swooper, he's a bat. Hello, little bat. How you, how you doing? Oh, uh, how you doing? Same dialogue, yeah, we already know this, okay, whatever. Um, hi guys, yeah. My name is Swoop. Sir Swoop, I mean. Nice to meet you. Aw, he's cute. He's nice, too. You, yes, you, Sir Swoop. It's time for your battle, bub. So he's fighting the Goomba Bros just like we did when, when we first got here. Ah, oh, the memories. Sir Swoop. I think we can go a bit longer. But before I do... Before I do anything... I just want to save. Wait, there's no music playing, is there? No, no, there is. It, it just kicked in, I think. That was really weird. There was no music. Do I have time for one more battle? Hmm. Maybe. Let's just see. Let's see what we're up against first. Reserve a match. Oh, that's where West Point it is. Rank 10 in the Glitz Pit. The Armed Harriers. That's right. You're darn rooting too, and you're finally going to make it. Oh. Ooh. We're going to the Major League now. Okay. No items in the other pockets. Okay. Well, you know what? I am going to leave this on a cliffhanger. I'm going to end the episode off here. Ugh! I'm going to end the episode off here. If you guys enjoyed... Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. And if you guys enjoyed, please do not forget to leave a like, subscribe, favorite, and comment, and click that bell to be notified with every new video I make. And, question of the day, how much do you miss King K? Because I really miss King K. Oh, I wish he'd come back. Tell me in the comments if you miss King K, because I do. And with that all said, I hope you all have a great day, and I'll see you in the next episode. See you later, guys.
It's a cliffhanger. Hey.